This is so not okay. I know my alarm did not just go off because it is the middle of the f night. <laughs> it is the middle of night. Alright, so due to how puffy my face is, I do have to do a little skincare this morning. Um, which I don't normally do when I have like fake tanner on. Because literally the less you put on your skin, the better it looks and the longer um, it lasts. But my eyes look like marshmallows. So we're going to do a little, a little TLC. Um, hmm. The best part of the morning. Hey everyone, it's Nies Lasky and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It feels like the middle of the night, one. Two, my phone decided to like restart in the middle of the night so my alarm didn't go off. So I'm like 20 minutes behind schedule, which is kind of stressing me out, but it's okay. I'm very tired. Which means I have a coffee the size of my head. Um, it's literally time for me to like already do my makeup. So we have no time to waste here. Let's go. But, um, yeah, I'm just, like, really not in the mood to be filming at all today. But, you guys. So, I can't lie to you guys, I really, really, highly, highly, highly dislike the matinee meats. I hate them when we have to go away. I hate them when they're here. I just, I don't know what it is. It's just not fun putting so much makeup on your face at seven o'clock in the morning. Screw that my little mojo I have going. The only good thing, honestly, which is a good thing, um, it's pretty much at the same time that we practice every day, so I guess it'll feel fine once we, like, get going, but, yeah. I don't know if any other gymnasts watch this at DNCAA, but I would love to hear if you hate competing in the afternoon as much as I do. I don't know what it is. It just doesn't feel, it just doesn't feel right, but, you know, gotta still pump myself up. Otherwise, you know, I'm not trying to score a 9-6 tonight, or this afternoon. So anyways, thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Next thing, the sun is like not out. So I, like, <laughs> I like can't see what I'm doing to my face. So I am relying solely on my phone and my ring light right now to let me know how, you know, how I'm looking. So if you see me, Pac-12 network looking like a clown just be like you know what she had no light she didn't know what she was doing anyway like what is that what i am not about to redo this whole thing all right i've decided i'm not redoing it i don't it's literally, who's gonna, yeah. Mm -hmm.
walking to get my hair done at Miley's apartment. Super handy that we live um, in the same place. All right, hair is done. Um, I have some makeup tweaking to do because I'm really not happy with how it looks. But anyways, then I am headed to the gym. Alright, and we're off. Since I'm behind schedule and I have the loveliest boyfriend on the planet, he has decided to go get me my coffee so I don't have to. So, no Starbucks adventure today. We are getting a vanilla latte, iced. Um, and yeah, so we're just headed to the gym. I'm feeling pretty good. I was in a really bad mood this morning. Um, I felt kind of ugh. Um, but yeah, after, you know, seeing the, the sun out, it's a beautiful day. It's a great day to be a Ute. I'm going to be thankful and grateful for this opportunity to compete in the middle of the day, no matter how much I might hate it. But anyways, uh, this is a long rant, but I'm going to jam out to some tunes and I will see you guys shortly. All right, so the parking lot is so full, but there is a God because some lady just pulled out in the front row, so it's gonna be a great day. I can't! You're so cute! <laughs> she looks like a little present, but like a mouse. You wanna come to our meet tonight? Well, All right guys, I had dinner and now I am back at my home. And my little meat recap, one, what the absolute hell was I doing on the floor? Like I landed the first pass short and then the second one I did a front layout for half. And then the last pass I like squeaked around. Maybe the judges thought I was cute. My score might've been a little more than it should have been. But you know what, Twitter people, be upset about it big whoop i've been underscored a few times i'll take the overscoring not my fault i don't hire the judges anyhow to the team little slow start on vault bars decent beam holy we went from a 49025 and we said seven tenths higher please thank you Anyway, Carly Dockendorf, the best beam coach in the country. You can't fight me on it. Then we went to floor and, you know, we weren't the same team we were last week, but you know, not the worst. Overall, we're happy. It was a damn good score. Probably gonna have to count it for our uh, NQS. So we're happy with that. Long story short, we are off to UCLA next week. We are pumped about it. It's probably one of our favorite meets of the year. We gotta travel to Southern California all that fun stuff. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications. And I will see you guys next time.